So here we're gonna have is gonna have like a little sailboat. It's gonna be like this little cove. So it's kind of um, probably somewhere in the Caribbean. It has this really nice uh, turquoise color. So it's probably Caribbean water. I can't imagine it's specific. Um, it's gonna be a cove. So it's gonna be this really light, really beautiful turquoise water. There's gonna be a darker turquoise here to kind of the shadow of the rock. Um, we're gonna have kind of a gray rock that goes up here. There's gonna be bushes here and there throughout the cliff. So I'm gonna have to um, alternate how the cliff looks, like this gray into shadow and then back and forth and then work on the bush. That's gonna be a little bit of a challenge because a lot of those colors are similar. And then finally, there's gonna be a big tree here. I might take that out. Um, I don't know if it adds much. The sail on the picture is closed, but I'll probably open it just to give a more dramatic impact. Um, the sailboat is blue, but you know, blue is kind of a lame color. I might do red on top of this blue. Um, we'll see what we do for it. All right, so the question of the day is, who is one of the more controversial impressionists? but the rough cut we kind of added in I added orange for the boat I didn't really like the dark blue um, orange really pops against turquoise so it just seemed like a better color choice um, I buried the sail I'll have to add it back in I want to get these rocks right and then just add the sail on top I think that's an easier way to execute the painting um, we got kind of the deck it's in gray but I think I got to add a lot more whites and blacks in there so we'll see how that develops um, there's a lot of subtlety in the top of the sailboat which I might simplify just to make it easier um, there needs to be kind of a darker line where the water meets because it's going to be a little bit darker there from the rock color and I kind of put some preliminary hits on the rock right now it looks pretty bad I would say but as we add in different shades it's going to make more sense I think as a painting. <laughs>
controversial impressionist was Gauguin. And not necessarily for the art, he was a revolutionary, he worked with uh, Van Gogh and he visited a lot of um, French Polynesia. And then it was like he kind of lived in Tahiti. So the reason why he was controversial besides making great art was when he was in Tahiti at the end of his life, you know, he must've been in his 80s or something. He married under Tahitian law, they could marry these natives and she was only 13, so. <laughs> Definitely kind of a eh, pedophile perhaps. Um, so yeah, kind of, I don't know if he took advantage of her or the family didn't care or yeah, who knows. Um, but yeah, he that was a controversy surrounding Gauguin. He has great art, but then artists are always like, yeah, but he was a real son of a bitch. Um, you know, Picasso was a woman, I was not always cheating as women, but they were full grown women they knew what they were doing when they got with picasso per se uh i don't think a 13 year old would know so this is the downside of gauguin uh great art but yeah you have this controversial edge most people don't know about it but then you find out about it you're like dude <laughs> so that's the question of the day all right we just finished the painting let's take a closer look So it has a sailboat. I opened the sail all the way. Um, originally it was closed, but I kind of like the composition with just the sail open. Um, the bottom of the boat looks really good. It looks like it's floating over that really translucent uh, Caribbean water. I was thinking I added more details in the sail, but you know I'm not quite sure what I would add in there. I mean, maybe numbers, but then it's like, if you don't do them right, then it's kind of like you start over and it's just a nightmare. Uh, I brought the skyline lower in a photo, I think it was just um, just barely touching the sky, but I brought that a little lower. So you got the, the two tones of uh, clear sky versus the turquoise water, so that's kind of a really nice contrast. Um, in this case, they don't need to be that close. Um, the Caribbean water is kind of that turquoise color, which is different than other seas where it's you know closer matching the sky. Um, the trees I'm not super happy about. I just left them as kind of shrubbery. I didn't really paint them as trees. You know, I simplified a little bit. Um, the cliffs look okay. Um, you know, I really don't like painting cliffs. It just seemed like you paint them over and over and over again. They only look right, right at the very end. Um, here, they're not quite looking quite right yet, but they read, I guess, as cliffs. Uh, we'll see if it sells. <laughs> anyway, uh, hopefully you guys like it. Give me a thumbs up. Uh, if you want to subscribe, you can subscribe below. And I'll see you in the next painting video. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.